Sunday Night Football visits Lambeau Field this weekend when the Packers take on the Bears. With it comes the Sunday Night Football bus. Yeah, it will be parked at Lambeau for the game, but it is making some special stops along the way to honor veterans. Katie Crowther was down at Great Lakes Naval Base checking it out. Hey, you guys, I'm here just chilling with my buddy Clay Matthews. Well, all right, you're on to me. You probably guessed it. He's just painted on the wall. This is just one of the very cool things in this bus. It's more than 300 square feet of NFL awesomeness. The Lombardi Trophy, signed footballs, interactive games, and all the gear Aaron Rodgers wears. Plus, Clay Matthews featured prominently both inside and out. We caught one little guy giving him a high five. <laughs> Who's your favorite Packers player? Um, Clay Matthews. Navy officers and their families got to take all the pictures they wanted with number 52's smiling face. Ooh, that is a keeper. And of course, I had to sneak a selfie in too. Smile pretty, Clay. We even witnessed a Bears fan taking a photo for a cheese head. Unfortunately for these Packers backers, the Great Lakes Naval Base is in Illinois. There are a lot of Chicago Bears fans here. I'm not scared of Chicago. <laughs> <laughs> the Packers are going to win, of course. The real win is that these servicemen and women who could be deployed overseas at any time get to experience this. It's nice to have uh, the support from the NFL, you know, coming out and respecting and honoring our veterans. It's a really, really cool thing. Here is the 2014 player of the game ball. Hopefully after Sunday's game, it will have a big Packers signature on it. And then when the season's all said and done, hopefully this beautiful thing will be in Green Bay. Katie Crowther, today's TMJ4. And the Packers, as we said, taking on the Bears Sunday Night Football on today's TMJ4 kickoff at 730. Time now for